Hello, Valley Brown the Perfume Don. I'm back at you with a very fun fragrance video. Thanks for tuning in. New subscribers, welcome to my Perfume Mafia. If you are not subscribed, go ahead, subscribe. Sorry, you guys. This is not for kids. I already marked that YouTube, so don't take this down. Anyways, if you really like perfume videos, if you like smelling good, go ahead, subscribe. Like, share this with someone else that really likes fragrance. Don't be a hoarder. And let's get into this video. So hopefully by the time you're watching this, if family, if you're watching this, I would have already given you these fragrances. So there's no need to spoil the surprise. But I want to show you guys what I'm gifting my family for, for Christmas. Um, so hopefully this is playing after Christmas. If not, then, well, you guys are in the know before them. Um, obviously I'm gifting, it's pretty much all women in my fra in my fragrance, all women in my family so I'm gifting them scents. Some of them I bought specifically for them. Some of them I'm just like, I've never used. I know you're really like, and they're pretty much all new. And I'm like, why not? Let's share the love. So for my middle sister, I am giving her, she won it. I can't open it and share it with you. But I have like a little mini review on my Instagram. It's Valley Von the Perfume Don. She wanted C Fiori. Eau de Parfum, very nice. And yo, she actually put me on to this scent because I had not, I just, I didn't know about this scent at all until she told me about it. So thanks, sis. Uh, I love the original C, but this one's just lighter, more floral, sweeter, kind of like creamy. Love this scent so much. So I know she's going to be smelling good for her husband. So I got her that one. And then she also mentioned, I already had a backup of Chloe Nomad. I, like I went crazy they had a sale before so I'm gonna give her my backup because she mentioned in conversation she was like I really like I was in the store and I really like that Chloe Nomad she already likes the original I gave her the original last year so she already knows that she likes a fresh floral scent and in that family Chloe that's pretty much what you're gonna get everything's a safe bet this one's a little bit of a departure I feel like it has a little bit of like a heavier spicy note I want to say there's plum in here or maybe a little bit of patchouli um, but yeah, so she says she really liked this one. So I was like, you know what? I'll just give you mine and then you'll be set for fragrances for 2020. So that's what I'm giving my middle sister. For my oldest sister, it seems she likes really dark fragrances. I gave her Jessica Simpson's stash and she just loved it. I gave her the, the gift set last year and she just absolutely loved it. So this year I'm going to give her Euphoria Calvin Klein. I mind myself how it smells. Yeah, this one kind of smells like dark, woody, spicy to me also. So I figured this would be something that she would really like. Um, it seems, and I, you know, not a lot of women really like those type of scents. So I'm happy that she does. Uh, so I'm going to give her that one. And then also so she can have something, because I, I looked in her collection when I was over her place. And it didn't seem like she had like a, a summer, you know, spring scent. Because, you know, Stash is nice, but it's kind of heavy, I think. So I'm going to give her... Uh, Michael Kors Coral, which is a nice, fruity, very, very fruity scent, but womanly. It's like a fruity, elegant scent. So those are the two I'm going to give my oldest sister. She's like middle aged, so these are perfect for her. Very nice, womanly, not little girl scents. She she's the type of woman that really likes a scent that announces itself. She's not afraid to wear something that's kind of like knock you out a little bit and um. She actually really hates scents that don't have like a lot of longevity. So that's why I decided she would be a good person to give those. For my mom, she is, oh my God, she is, I want to say she's like worse than me when it comes to perfume, but she loves perfume too. And she does fragrance videos on here as well. So I'll link her channel because she has other fragrances that I don't have um, that you can check out and learn about them. But I'm going to give her quite a few and I might go into that closet girl and give her some more because it's like I want to give her more fragrances because I know she reviews them and she really likes them. But she's also like the type that's kind of like won't really wear them because she wants to save them. I'm like, just wear them. You live once. I'm not the kind of person. Sometimes I like try to conserve and not go crazy because I am an over sprayer. But I'm like, I'm going to spray everything. I don't care. $300 perfume, $2 perfume. I want to smell amazing. So for my mom, I'm going to get her, I, well, I got her, Idole by Lancome, because I feel like she also needed just like a fresh everyday scent. And I thought this was really nice and she likes Lancome. I got her Tresor like years ago, so we'll see. Another one that I got her, I decided to give her 
you saw it in my Chanel video. Um, the Coco Mademoiselle and my Ulta haul. This is Chanel Paris Eau de Parfum Intense. The Coco Mademoiselle Eau de Parfum Intense. Very nice. I feel like this is a strong scent. Oh, did I break it? Avante. You see, you know what? Avant, girl, don't break it. Why is this so hard coming out? You know, we're going to let her live. Um, because I'll mess around and break it. And then Christmas would be ruined. But anyways, that's what I got her. Um, so, I, do, I know she wants something a little bit strong. So, I got her that. Another one I got her is that she really likes vintage scents. She, you know, she's my mom. She's a little bit older. So, she likes those. It used to be like in the 80s and the 90s. The very strong. Well, not the 90s. In the 80s. A strong knock em, sock em, beast mode fragrance was ideal. So I got her a vintage one. I, this is actually a great deal. This is Halston. I got this for her. Vintage scent, but I think, what is it called? A Sheepra? A Sheepra scent? Yeah, that's a Sheepra scent. She likes a Sheepra scent. She really loves Bill Blast. I got that for her a little while ago. I'm not a huge fan of those scents, but I know she likes them. Um, so I got that for her. Hopefully she likes it. This is Elizabeth... Yeah, I don't like. Oh, I'm so happy that era is gone. Oh, I know everybody's running around stonky back in the day. Okay, Elizabeth Arden Splendor is another one that I got for her because we were actually in the store one day and we picked this up and sprayed it. And I think this is another like sheep scent, very fresh, floral, very linen, but like heady, musky sheep scent. If you've ever smelled. It kind of reminds me of like um, Cal Calbatine de Gras. That scent, that, that's what these two kind of remind me of. So those are the ones that I'm going to get people for the holiday season. What are you guys gifting as far as fragrances? Um, I might go back in that closet. And actually I have a Hannah Mori, I think the butterfly one that I haven't been reaching for. And it's the gift set. So I think I may give that to her as well. Um, But that's what I'm going to give them. What are you guys gifting for the holiday season as far as fragrance? Let me know. Comment below. Like, share this with someone. Subscribe. Join my Perfume Mafia. And I'll check you guys. Peace. Peace.